guys, today we're making one of my new favorite pasta recipes. It's a Calabrian chili pasta and I've literally been dreaming of this ever since I got back from Milan last summer. Calabrian chilies are everything. To start, we're just gonna chop up a little bit of garlic. We're gonna start with six garlic cloves. All right, so we're just gonna give this a rough chop. Nothing too precise is needed. And this, I wanna talk to you guys about Calabrian chilies because these are an Italian pepper that are so delicious. They're a little spicy and they're gonna make your pasta shine. All right, garlic's chopped, pasta water is boiling. We're just gonna cook this off until it's al dente, which for this specific pasta is 10 minutes. While that's going, we're gonna make our sauce. So we'll just turn a skillet over high heat. And then we've got a third of a cup of olive oil. We're just gonna pour that right in. We're gonna go ahead and make our sauce and you can see that the oil is shimmering, which means it's hot, so we're ready to add things to it. First thing we'll do is add all that beautiful garlic. And that's just gonna saute for like 30 seconds by itself, not very long. Your whole house is about to smell real fragrant. And after a couple seconds, we're gonna put the chilies directly in here. We're just gonna stir all of that to combine. Look at that beautiful color, which is gonna get soaked up into the pasta as soon as we drain it. One of the last components into the sauce is we're gonna zest the lemon, save the lemon, and we're gonna juice it once the pasta's in. Before we drain this out, we're just going to reserve a little bit of that pasta water because it has so much flavor in there. We'll just put it right on our cutting board and then we'll drain this off. This is just going straight into our chili sauce. I mean, this is where all the magic happens. The pasta is perfectly cooked. The sauce is clinging to the pasta exactly how it should. This is going to be everything. I feel like I did when I was in Italy and someone made something like this for me. And like the pasta, the brilla is so authentic. You feel like you're just should be in Italy in a vineyard with a glass of wine and a bowl of pasta. All right, we are just going to salt this to taste and then squeeze the rest of the lemon on top. And then we just need, if you were using a thicker sauce, that's when you'd want to use a lot of water of the reserve water. So we're just gonna put like a couple tablespoons in. All right, let me give this a quick little stir. Look at it, you can see like the specks of chili in there, the garlic. Let me just give this a quick taste and then we can plate it up. Mm. Literally, one of the most incredible pastas I've ever made. Everyone is gonna love this for dinner tonight. I'm gonna plate it up and serve it and you guys can get the recipe on whatscobbycooking.com.